is up my fellow citizens long time no see how's everyone doing um it's been a long time it's been about what uh nine months since i've done a video but the character has brought me back it, this this is the shit that kind of started off with my ship addiction to star citizen and had me very excited but we're doing an og style uh ship tour video in the hangar it looks beautiful in here too by the way just something about doing inside your hangar. I don't I don't know. I just love it. But let's get down there and check it out. Yeah, I think the Carrick was 2014. And that's when I actually bought my first package. So this concept, concept ship came out around that same time. I had... What ships did I start? So the, the Avenger was my first package in March. And then I think the second ship was my Gladius. And then I got an M50... And the ship I was really cherishing the most, I really wanted, was the Retaliator. I was waiting on that thing forever. So, uh, Retaliator, and then I think, so yeah, that was my my first big ship. Well, okay, that's kind of like medium. My first big, big ship was the Reclaimer. Then, the Care came out as a concept afterwards. So, it was a crazy year, uh, 2014. This thing is huge. It definitely it got it got bigger, um, you know, throughout the concept. I guess people don't like that's a little fatter, but that doesn't really bother me. The only thing that really bothers me was the uh, the thrusters. Oh boy, <laughs> yeah, this this thing uh, it, get, it got me so hype. I'm glad it's finally in game now, so we could talk about other ships. Though <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, because all I used to hear was "care, care, 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 care," and now it, now it's here. So, which I'm shocked the Reclaimer, by the way, came first over this. I'm I was really shocked. Look at those side turrets. That looks cool. That look, that like uh, like the cockpit of a Tie Fighter right there. If you move the guns a little bit, well, just well, just a little bit. Yeah, well, she's huge. She's, she's she's floating a little bit for some reason. Okay. Okay, look at this. That's how you know you're in PTU. You got these little purple shield blocking things. I love this armor, by the way. It kind of, um, it looks like, it gives me Warframe vibes. It came with the, um, man, I forgot the name of that ship. I haven't made a ship video in so long. Yeah, them thrusters. I mean, eh. Okay, in-game, it doesn't look as bad or in the demo. It's just I wanted a real big squared off thruster that it, like it's not typically round. Like in, in the in the concept design, if you see it, those thrusters were so unique. And I'm just I don't know these are just I eh, eh. <laughs> but it's cool. I ain't going to complain too much. Oh, let's let's get inside this thing. Whew. Oh my goodness. Got some turrets at the bottom. I don't even know how to get in. Yeah, guys, this, so this is my first time seeing inside. Let's see if we can find this bad boy. What the hell is all these dots popping up? All right, we're going to find this way to get in. Oh, is this it? Nope. Oh, oh. oh there's, you know what? There's a front ramp. I'm stupid. I forgot there's a... Front ramp to get in. If we can access it. I'm going to have to play Will It Fit. Oh, wait. Okay, I'm getting something. Well, I didn't see. I just clicked it. Oh, oh. Ooh. That, that, that shield looks real nice. I mean, that windshield, glass, whatever you want to call it. I wonder if I could spawn one of my cars. So yeah, it's pretty roomy in here. I like um in the video how they got this little ramp. They kind of I would say geo proof it if you ask my org, cause uh I tear shit up. So for them to put that little ramp, we can't come here and, and tear shit up. That's pretty good. <laughs> is this it? Oh, that's the open door, closed door. Oh, okay, here it is, right here. There it is. Boom. So yeah, you can't back up and accidentally kill somebody. I think that's a real cool safety uh feature. <laughs> Cause for people like me, that's that, that you need that. 
Close, close, close. I want to see it close. Man, if you need to get a quick getaway, this thing goes up pretty slow. It goes up and down pretty slow. Just a tad bit faster, I would like to see it, but... All right, where does this go? This is a service ladder. Let's try this one first. This is down here. Ooh. All right. Good old Anvil, man. Anvil, is, I think, is my second favorite. Uh, this, These things are cool. I'm sorry. And they, it was cool is it actually glows in-game, even though it's a bug. But Anvil is probably my second favorite shit manufacturer, even though Crusader's giving them a, a run for their money. Crusader may mess around be my second. I don't even know what... Okay, uh... Man, where do we start? Okay, we'll start from the back. Oh, so there's an elevator I could have took this whole time. So, habitation deck, sub deck, technical deck. Was that the drone? <gasps> okay, maybe that is the drone. Let's go in there. Ooh, are the drones in there? Ah, they're not in there. I should have figured that. I would have probably been seeing them by now. That is cool. Can you sit in here? You know, I don't want to sit in there and something breaks in PTU, so I'm pretty sure nothing's functional. You can't see nothing right now anyways. But this is a cool little drone room. Yeah, I always said the Carrick, in my opinion, well, when it first came out, and now it's more expensive. In, in, in terms of Star Citizen, if you've been around, I always thought the Carrick was, like, the best value ship for everything it does like jack of all trades uh, type deal going on you can hold a uh, land vehicle and you could hold a, a ship inside snub nose so snub fighter what is that i'm trying to... okay some kind of repair bay that's what i thought i seen so you get to repair some stuff in here maybe like weapons and stuff got some escape pods for everybody to get out oh so we was going towards the front of the ship. Oh, well, since we're here, might as well look at it. The top deck. What's now what station is this? Will it even let me get in? It says something okay, enter support seat. Okay, so support. You no, know, I was kinda on the fence with the globe or having a table. I mean this looks cool as hell though, over the table. And usually, you know, mapping stuff out is easier on a table. I don't know. People are arguing back and forth with that. I, I'm kind of, you know, I'm either way with it. Because that's Gunner. That one's support. And then this is like, I think this is the first, this is a command station. But I think they said you could pilot it from here. I'm actually going to get in this one. Just so I could see. Yeah. So, yeah, this is the, the first ship that you could, um stand on oh my goodness <laughs> oh I can't even get the view all the way damn glare that looks badass though were those engines on okay now I'm about to say the engines on in the, in the damn yeah that is cool so I'm glad you could stand in this. Look at that view, though. Just a great view. Let's hop out of here. Look, that's so quick. You don't have to wait for a chair. I'm a, okay. I'm a fan of the standing. You know, I don't like standing desk in real life. You could just boop, walk away, and gotta wait for the animation to get out. So that, that's some nice access. I do like that. So yeah, top top deck is uh is lit. I like that. All right, let's go back over here. That's kind of sucks though. Everyone has to kind of come up here to uh, get to the escape pods. Should have had like maybe half down there for a squad and half up here. I don't know. Oh, we gotta check that room out already. All right, so the, so technically, so we going towards the back is that way. I'm so damn stupid. I went to the ramp thinking I was going back in there. Yeah, so this hangar looks like it could hold. Maybe the, um, what's the other one? The anvil that, that folds up. Let's go in there and check it out. Uh-oh. 
I just walked through the door, didn't I? Oh, wait, no. I'm not walk through it because I may die. I actually died in the hangar first time today I ever died in the hangar. The hell is this floating? Is it like a power plant or something? Or thrusters? That's so strange. Yeah, I think you could definitely get one of those in here. Above that, I don't know. You, you're pushing it. <laughs> it has to be stuff with some folding wings. Well, some of the fighters. Um, man, it's like I don't know where I want to go. Well, let's check out the turret. This looks so cool. I love this turret entrance. I just get the, the Millennium Falcon vibe, you know, Han and Luke going to the turrets right here. Ah! Glorious. And I think they um they said they fixed it with a turret stick out more in the video because it was hard to uh, shoot or something like that. Oh, my God, dude. Oh, yeah, this looks pretty good. Oh, hey, which one am I in? Okay, this one over here. Okay. Yeah, if I could get the... Eh, it's kind of hard. Dude, it looks like a TIE fighter with the, the, the wings ripped off. But that is awesome. I love that they go out in its, its own little pod. Yeah, that's diggy dope. Some good coverage, too. Play some ground support. You want to shoot like, do, 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 do. Yeah, I'm digging this. Man, I look so badass. Oh, uh, what's in here? Okay, so this is like an engine room, of course. Seems like engines are always in fire in, inside the hangar. Yeah, I don't know what's the point of kind of looking in there. I guess if stuff was so messed up, you can't really get inside if it was burning up, I guess. And no point in going in the other turret. Same thing, only different side. You got a service elevator for this one. So you got upper in, uh, engine, eh, engineering and lower engineering. Let's check out up here a little more. I don't even know if there's a room that you could go back and get confused with. Uh oh. Okay, so this opens, I guess this is for like components and stuff. Or a module. This is a good little hiding spot. Oh, I'm prone. Prone, you son of a gun. Oh. 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 Wowzers. That was. <laughs> well, that wasn't a good idea. I guess it's not a good hiding spot. <laughs> Woo. Oh, man. I'm going to have to start all over. Well, well. Go back to the front, work our way back. <laughs> but once that gets fixed, that's a good hiding spot for some uh, ship intruders coming in. Like, I'm just an explorer, man. I don't want no smoke. I'm going to just leave this open now. Ain't no one in here but me. Ain't got to worry about no trolls. All right, well, you know, since we started upstairs, okay, these are the elevators, so both the elevators go up. Oh, okay, so this is the cargo room. I think it's the cargo. It looks like it. Some more cargo pods. Okay, so that's all the stuff that's up here. Ooh, thought I was about to fall through again. So what are these like beds? Huh? I don't. They look like standing beds, I guess. They can be because I think there's bunks in here. So I, I don't know what these are. Oh, there's a weapons locker. That's cool. Now, only weapons lockers um, that I know that work 
are the ones on the Drake. I haven't. Well, to be honest, that's the only one. Uh, Drake Cutlass. That's the only one I really tried, so I can't, I can't say uh, the other ships. Okay, so this elevator's acting bougie. He doesn't want to let me in. Eh, whatever. All right, this is the aft turret. So, yeah, we'll take the elevator back up. So maybe we should have started through here, then worked our way up. <laughs> Okay. Increase sensitivity. Oh man, yeah, this sensitivity on this bad boy. I can't wait till we get turrets working, man. That's that's one of the main things, you know, I'm waiting on. I think once turret gameplay gets better, it's gonna be a much better experience for everyone. That's that's one of the main things. For a uh, multi crew, if you ask me. Okay, so yeah, this just double check again. Oh. Oh. So you just it didn't have to have the little bubble. You just clicked on it and it worked. Okay, that's cool. Um, I want to say we were on man. Were we on four? I think we're. I think we were on four. Oh no. Okay. So I wasn't on four. I must have been on three. <gasps> no, I wasn't on this deck. Oh, bro, I'm so lost. I don't know. I'm lost and I like it though. Oh, this thing is freaking sweet. I'm getting like some Mass Effect vibes off this. Ho oh. ho ho. Oh, oh boy. You can't really do nothing with it, but that yeah, that that is cool. So wait a minute, does the other map I don't know. Okay, well <laughs> I'm not even gonna get myself confused right now. That's elevator. Uh we're going this is going front. Uh oh. Oh, that's an escape pod, okay. Okay, so I do have multiple um, escape pod routes, so that's cool. Ah, this is where you could go outside, get some fresh air. I think this is where also where the uh, ship lands too. I'm on top of the world. I don't want to go too far down where I can't get my ass back up. Or can I on those sides? I probably could on those sides. Oh, yeah, this is cool. <laughs> so armor goes perfect with this uh, ship. All right. Yeah, this looks cool. I love this. Okay, there's a top turret. So is that okay? That one's remote, I think. Yep, yeah, remote. Uh, almost I thought that was a door over here. All right, so we should probably take the elevator back. Wait, is this okay? That's another escape pod. Oh, one that comes up or something like that. These things, whatever they are, I don't know what these are. Okay, so this one's lit. Where's the okay, back to the elevator? I like that, just clicking on it and it just works. Oh, see, I see what's going on where you could just interact with the, the UI and the computer. See, that's dope. Um, okay, so maybe we were on the technical deck? Maybe? Okay, yeah, we were definitely on the technical deck. Okay. Let's finish our way in the back, in the engineering room. <laughs> What? So, oh man, why am I steady going back? And I should have knew better when I looked going this way. Oh, yeah, it's gonna take me a little. While. It takes me a while to get used to ships. 
I think uh, not too long ago, I just got used to the uh, the Starfarer. All right, so yeah, we check this part. You open that. We'll take the stairs and check out the lower part. Oh, wait. Can it go just right here? Or do we have to take it all the way down? Okay. This is the lower part. Oh, where does this go to then? Okay, so some, some more components. Armaments. Got your typical fire in the hangar. So yeah, engineers are gonna have a, a little decent sized room to work in. See, now this is, I, I, see, I don't wanna go with some shit I fall through. I, think, I don't know if the component's missing, or you like you could hide here. Okay, see now this one just looks like a regular box. You could, yeah, okay, you could put something in there, store stuff in. Okay, this one doesn't open. I don't. Oh wait, I lied. It does open. Shield generator. Oh, okay, this is the radar. Okay, so radar's supposed to go in here. Life support supposed to go in there. Shield generator. Does this say? Okay, power plant. Reading is essential, kids. <laughs> Shield generator. Okay, so that's that's pretty sweet. <clears throat> Fuel tank. Oh yeah, you're gonna cooler. Yeah, the engineers guys gonna have your handful down here. Under camp combat, you have maybe one upstairs and uh, one downstairs. More fuel tank access. Sweet. I will take the elevator back this time. Yeah, I do like that. I just like pressing this and getting it going. All right, go to upper. Yeah, some big ass engines, bro. Beautiful. I loves it. I loves it. All right, uh, all right, so back in front. It's gonna let me in. <laughs> we are checked out the front. So now, habitation deck. I hope I'm not missing something. I probably am. <laughs> So, oh, okay. So that's blurred out on purpose. Okay, I like that. That's that's cool. Whoa, what is this? Please wait. Is this like a contamination? I guess make sure you spray the germs off you so you don't get no damn uh, coronavirus. <laughs> okay, so it's the medical station. Wow, this one looks cool. Man, like I said, this thing is like the jack of all traits, man. <laughs> I like this medical room. This is pretty sweet. Oh, yeah, this one. Did. Ah, yeah, this one is real nice. Okay, I have a couple of doctors on board. There's like some lab shit going on. Test blood samples and stuff. And say you get sick or something, you gotta find out what the disease is and make a cure or something real quick. Oh man, Whew, the possibilities, man. Um, do I want to go back through here? Okay, let's go back through here. Yeah, man, this, man, this thing is, this thing is real sweet. Oh, that's the elevator. Whoops. We don't want to go back that way. Not just yet. Work our way up here. What's in here? Open sesame. What's going on? Well, don't know what's in that room, but all right.
those are for. Nice little view, some tongs. Read some stuff, chill out here. They like some stuff that forks and stuff go in and knives. Got a planner, screen on there. I mean, hopefully you can change it to TV on there. Oh yeah, play a little pool, baby. I can't wait till this is active because I love freaking pool. Ah, okay. Crew quarters, you can sleep, you can sit. Each crew bunker has its own little TV, little bunk bed. That's, that is sweet. I like that. What's this right here? Okay, store your clothes and armor and stuff. Got the bathroom. Take a shower. Well, actually, yeah, you could just take a shower in here. Where's the toilet at? Yeah, no toilets. That's probably this is pretty good then, because some people taking a shower, you in there shitting it up. So maybe you gotta poop somewhere else then, unless I'm missing something. No, yeah. Maybe that's why I left that other room. Maybe that was the bathroom. Oh, this is another bathroom right here. Oh, well, we just solved that problem right there. <laughs> Toilets and stuff over here. So I like that. <laughs> hey, people come in here, shit and piss over here, and then take a shower on that side. Sweet. And that's kind of weird in, in between the entertainment. Now you're over there getting dressed and showering and taking a shit, and then, boop, people coming out playing pool. Uh -huh, I guess. Let me try this door one more time. I'm determined. Uh, uh, let me glitch through. Uh. Yeah, I don't know what's in there. I don't know what's in there. If anyone has seen that, let me know. Ah, captain's room. Come to my office. Why haven't we made the jump yet? Hmm? 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 All right. That is, that is cool right there. Uh, let me see. So the TV could pop. The TV could pop down. That is sweet. Oh, both of them. So you don't want to see your nobody come in and see your flight plans. That's a wine. Some chess. If you want to come in and play. Uh, picture of New York. In the future. Got some beer. I wish my bed was a little better. Bag locker. So I got the, the shower and toilet combination going on. So I don't mind if it's combination for my own bathroom, but a public bathroom? Come on, man. Come on. What's that, shavers? What's that, hot, like them hot rocks? Ashtray type thing going on, okay. And these, okay, that's a, another storage. Kind of wish my own personal weapon locker was back here. I don't know what this is. Is it? Nah, I don't, I don't say. Aha, the bridge. Yeah, it looks much cooler from the top. Not gonna lie. All this stuff, server access stuff. All right. Oh, what the hell is this? Wait. So what does that do? Hey, what goes in there? Boy, I I don't know what that is. Uh, let's see. Sitting here, see how it looks from this angle. Oh, wow, that looks cool. Looks cool with the struts. You know, I'm not a strut fan, but it's like the right amount of struts. 
the right amount of stress are done right, it's cool. Yeah, I could deal with this. Like the ones on the RSI uh, constellation, I'm like, oh, I, I just, I don't know. Screens all over. Feel like y'all by yourself in front of here. Does this one have? Okay, yeah, it did. What's the role for this one? Okay, co-pilots. What's this one? So, oh wow, so two co-pilots. All right. I think we explored this whole floor. Okay, that's for the bridges. Okay, so let's run back and go to the first floor now. Oh, nope. Forgot I gotta go around. All right. Sub deck, let's go. Last deck, if I didn't miss anything besides that one room we couldn't get in. Actually, I think we were here, weren't we? Yeah, we did check this out with the uh, weapon lockers and stuff. I don't know if we went all the way back. Oh, yeah, okay. So, yeah, we did see the sub deck. So, yeah, we're going to have to... Uh, I'm, I'm going to take this thing for a main flight with, with a crew. Check some stuff out in the atmosphere because this thing is awesome. I got to take it to Microtech. Like, I, I want to see this thing... Land in Microtech, test out the flight, see how it goes. Let's go put a, uh, a rover in it real quick. If I can even spawn it. This thing takes up almost the whole hangar. I can't wait till we see, because I remember they were talking about hangars connected in the game. I, I don't know what happened. Um, We heard something about that last year, but I, it's been kind of quiet since then. No, I don't want that. I want... I thought there was a vehicle thing over here. Oh yeah, cause see this this should have been fixed with the with the floor. You can't even find the damn dots. Nah, we'll take a we'll take a tumbler. I'll take it. Why not? Well, we know a rover fits in there. Just, let's try to put two of these in there instead. Coop and you know, uh oh, will it not work? Oh, it's not even gonna let us do it. Well, uh, whatever. But I will see you guys later. Hope you guys enjoyed the vid because this, this thing is freaking awesome. <laughs> It is cool, even though it the thrusters ain't like I wanted. It's still a cool ship, and I think I'm gonna have a lot of fun in the verse. But you guys have a blessed day and one more thing, Star Citizen for life. <laughs>